At five, Alabama's Marine Police say they're going to work overtime this Memorial Day weekend. As so many of you are getting your first chance this season to get out on the water. That's right. Our Brian Henry getting out on the water today, taking a boat ride with an officer on Lake Tuscaloosa this morning. And Brian joining us live now with what Marine Police say about this year's holiday. Well, Brittany, Jonathan, Marine Police are encouraging boaters and vacationers on Alabama waterways to think, don't be careless, and make this a safe outing for everyone. Lake Tuscaloosa is quiet and placid, but not for long. Hundreds of boaters are on the way, and Marine Police Corporal Freddie Ingram and his team will be ready. We will have uh, the entire weekend, we'll be working overtime. Overtime to cover 1,800 miles worth of shorelines and 30 nautical miles. The deepest part is around 100 feet near the dam. Corporal Ingram says boaters need to know there's been a change in the emergency switch turnoff law. It now encompasses every boat that's 26 foot or, or shorter. And if you're producing at least three horsepower, that means 115 uh, pounds of propulsion, then you have to have that lanyard hooked to your body. Also, it is now a law that you have to report any boat in accident within 24 hours. Ingram says it never fails. They end up writing numerous citations. A lot of them are safety violations. They extend from careless operation to reckless operation. We do have a lot of alcohol violations. We have BUI, we have minor in possession or minor in consumption of alcohol. All this despite the fact there's an ordinance against alcohol on the lake, a notable fact some boaters tend to ignore, according to Corporal Ingram. They've worked hard all week, they've worked hard all year, they have a long holiday, and it's kind of a, a time for them to let their hair down and kick back, and they just kind of don't think about the laws. Or the deadly consequences that could happen on the water. Marine police say they're not here to squelch anyone's fun, but to encourage people to think with a clear head and help prevent the unthinkable. Corporal Ingram says based on history, he expects around 500 boaters per day over the next three days on Lake Tuscaloosa. In Tuscaloosa, Brian Henry, WBRC Fox 6 News, on your side. All right.